Yes, sir. They give them chicken, rice, and assorted wines. Pastor, we are, in fact, if care is not taken, we are on the way to losing more members. <laughs> so, since church is now going everywhere, ah, and people ah. are, we are now doing competition, competition. The competition is the no problem. You will know that we are already in the distance before it's for hard for fathers. Yes. Oh, now I understand. You see, I know what to do. Yeah, they are pastor. Do you know? Do you know his name? I don't think. Yeah, I don't think. I don't think. I don't need that. You see, by the time I finish with their pastor, just go and stay glue with social media and television stations. They will announce him. By the time what I want to do fall upon him, he will discover that he's more popular than the president. Mm. Eh? <laughs> just stay glue. <laughs> I don't need to say it. It's a prophecy. <laughs> Since when? Since when the soldiers on the same side compete against one another? I thought soldiers were meant to complement each other. So why then do they fight against each other in this combat against the enemy? Why then do we have choristers fighting it over who takes the solo? Please help me. Why then do we have members of the ushering team fighting over who stays beside the pastor or the VIPs? Why then do we have drama ministers? Fighting or getting bitter over who takes the lead role. Please help me. Why then do we have pastors getting envious and bitter over another pastor who seems to have a bigger congregation? Envy has eaten deep into the body of Christ. Or don't we read the same Bible? That talks about a man called John the Baptist. As anointed as he was, he was contented being the way maker for the Messiah. Even when his disciples tried to stir envy and jealousy in him, he said, he said, I must decrease for him to increase. John understood the power of your capacity. Don't you know that some have been given five talents, others two, one respectively. So why don't you stay in the capacity that God has given you? Why don't you stop the envy? Why don't you stand up and be the best that God has made you to be? At the end of the day, <laughs> your designation will, will determine your reward. Are we not end time soldiers? Take for example in the military, we have combatant soldiers, we have soldiers who are musicians, we have soldiers who are engineers, but they still bear the name soldiers. 
Why don't you stay in the little capacity that God has given you and be the best? Let's stop the envy. Why don't we work together and be together as a force that will take over the world? My name is Obemi Akitunde, and you just watched one of my deep thoughts. God bless you.